dear students welcome in this math class uh, in this video we'll discuss about one extra question and this is very important question and taken from class 10 chapter 9 and uh, the question is the angle of elevation of an aeroplane from a point on the ground is a 60 degree right okay after a flight of 30 seconds the angle of elevation changes to 30 degree if the plane is flying at a constant height of 3600 root 3 meter find the speed of the plane in kilometer per hour okay so let's understand the question first line is the angle of elevation of a, of an aeroplane from a point on the ground is a 60 degree okay suppose this is aeroplane right and this is a point on the ground this is point on the ground so here see uh, this is point on the ground which is point c and this is point a and aeroplane is at point b right so here you can see it is given that suppose b point is here right okay so it is said that the angle of elevation from this point c is a 60 degree so from c point if you see this aeroplane this is ray of sight okay and this is horizontal so this angle is given to you 60 degree now next line is after a flight of 30 second the angle of elevation changes to 30 degree so after 30 seconds suppose this aeroplane reached at point this d point okay so after 30 second he has reached at point d suppose this is point d now the angle of elevation of this d point from the point c is now changes to 30 degree so if you see Dear yes, students, आपके साथ एक बहुत ही amazing बात करने जा रहा हूँ। अगर आप CBSE class 8 से लेकर 12 तक के students हैं, या फिर IIT, JE, NEET की तैयारी कर रहे हैं, तो an academy लेकर आया है आपके लिए mega offer, जहाँ आपको मिल रहा है an academy का 45 days का plus subscription, जो कि usually 10,000 rupees का होता है, वो आपको सिर्फ 299 rupees की cost पर दिया जाएगा। और यही नहीं अगर आप मेरा कोड RAKESS2022 जो कि आपको स्क्रीन पर दिख रहा है इसको यूज करेंगे तो आपको इस पर एडिशनल 10% ऑफ दिया जाएगा यानी कि 10000 रुपीस का सब्सक्रिप्शन ऑलमोस्ट 270 रुपीस में इजंट इट इंटरेस्टिंग ऑफर बहुत ही लिमिटेड है और वैलिड है सिर्फ 30th अप्रैल 2022 तक तो अभी मेरा कोड RAKESS2022 यूज करें और परचेज कीजिए अपना मनपसंद कोर्स और अपने एग्जाम की तैयारी स्टार्ट कीजिए तो डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिए लिंक पर क्लिक करें और क्रैक करें अपना टारगेट एग्जाम D point from point C then your ray of sight will be this and this is your horizontal so this angle is changes to 30 degree now right okay so uh, here you can draw this height and it is said that the aeroplane is flying at a constant height constant height 3600 root 3 it means this height de you can say 3600 root 3 meter or you can say ab also 3600 root 3 meter so height of the aeroplane from the ground point is 36 meter constant height it is okay height is not getting changed okay and bd distance it has traveled in 30 second earlier it was on point b after 30 second it was on point d so angle also changes from 60 degree to 30 degree so we need to find out the speed of the plane in kilometer per hour okay first of all let's find out the speed of the aeroplane so what we do this uh, for bd distance we have the time time we have 30 second for traveling bd distance so our motive is to find the distance bd okay or bd you can say or ae you can say these both are equal so our motive is to find the distance ae because we know for ae it has taken 30 second time is there with us for ae distance we will find out and then we know speed is equal to distance over time so we have time already we will find out ae distance that what will be the distance ae whatever will be the distance ae will come we'll divide that distance with 30 we get the speed so okay we know distance over time is speed 
So let's find out AE distance, how to find out AE. And it is also very simple how to find out AE. So in a big right angle triangle, CDE, see here, in right angle triangle, CDE, you have DE distance. You can find out CE. If you have DE distance, DE distance is this, you can find out CE distance. Okay. In small right angle triangle ABC, you have AB distance this, you can find out AC. AC can be found out. Okay. Now if CE minus AC you will do, CE minus AC you will get AE only. Again see, CE minus AC is equal to AE. So you can minus these you will get the answer that is AE distance. So this way we will find out the distance AE, then we'll divide the distance AE by time, we get the speed. So uh, let B is the initial position of the aeroplane, C is point of observation, angle BCA is 60 degree, and after 30 second, let position of plane is at point D, and angle DCE, this is DCE that is 30 degree now, and here the heights AB is equal to DE is equal to 3600 root 3 meter given. So in a big right angle triangle ADE or sorry CDE will find out the value of CE. Okay. So CDE, CE will write in the numerator over DE that is denominator is equal to base over perpendicular that is cot 30. Right. So CE we need to find out and what is the DE value 3600 root 3 is equal to cot 30 is root 3 only. So from here CE is 3600 into root 3 into root 3 is 3. So 3600 into 3 is 10800 or you can say 10800 meter. So this is the value of C. This is equation number 1. Now similarly we will find the value of AC also in small right angle triangle. So right here in right angled triangle CAB in CAB what we do uh, AC we need to find out so AC over AB AB is given to us so B over P again cot 60 right so AC we need to find out AB is 3600 root 3 is equal to 1 by root 3 right because cot 60 is 1 by root 3 cross multiply so AC is equal to 3600 root 3 over root 3. So this is cut. So 3600 AC will come. So now we'll subtract this. Okay. So we'll write here distance. Distance AE is equal to CE minus AC. So what is CE here? 10800 minus 3600. So this is 7200 meter will come distance AE. So time taken to travel AE, time to travel AE. So that is 30 second, right? It is given to us. So speed will automatically be, we know that distance over time. So distance is 30, uh, 7200 over 30. So cut, cut, uh, this is uh, 3 twos are or 24 okay 240 okay so our speed is 240 meter per second so dear students it is asked that we need to find out the speed in kilometer per hour. so we need to multiply by 18 over 5 right so you can say why 18 over 5 i can tell you this also so i tell you see here uh, first i am multiplying uh, this by 18 over 5 and it will be kilometer per hour so 5 ones are 5 here it will be uh, 5 4 fours are 20 and 5 eights are so 48 into 18 is 864 kilometer per hour will be the answer okay so here uh, the speed in kilometer per hour is 864 kilometer per hour so i tell you why it is multiplied by 18 by 5 so meter per second see here meter per second so we know how to change meter into kilometer Okay, that will be divided by 1000 and here uh, second into R. So in one hour 3600 seconds are there. So we need to divide by 3600. So here this over 3600 that 3600 will go up. So if you cut these it will come 18 over 5 only. So this way we can find why we have multiplied by 18 over 5. So this is our answer. Thanks for watching.